The much-anticipated third season of Heartstopper has finally arrived, and it carries with it a sense of growing maturity while maintaining the heartwarming essence that fans have come to love. The series, based on Alice Oseman's graphic novels, continues to follow the lives of Nick, that is Kit Connor, and Charlie, that is Joe Locke, as they navigate the emotional landscape of young love. However, this season marks a deeper exploration into the complexities of their relationship, tackling sensitive themes like mental health and intimacy with the same tenderness that has defined the show since its debut. In season three, Nick and Charlie's relationship reaches a new level of emotional depth. While the series delicately explores the idea of when they might be ready for a more intimate connection, it does so in a way that feels authentic and non-exploitative, reflecting the thoughtful and respectful approach Heartstopper has always taken. The series treats these moments as precious, like handling fine china, ensuring that the focus remains on emotional connections rather than sensationalism. This is especially evident in scenes between Elle, that is Yasmin Finney, and Tao, that is William Gao, whose relationship is depicted with such care, emphasizing the importance of understanding each other's boundaries and experiences. One of the standout aspects of this season is the show's willingness to address mental health issues in a nuanced and compassionate way. Charlie's struggles with an eating disorder come to the forefront, and Nick finds himself grappling with how best to support his partner. These moments are portrayed with quiet sincerity, offering a glimpse into the emotional challenges that can arise even in the strongest relationships. Kit Connor and Joe Locke shine in these scenes, particularly in Charlie's sessions with a psychiatrist, played by Eddie Marsan. The conversations feel real and grounded, providing a level of emotional insight that resonates deeply with viewers. The inclusion of new faces like Haley Atwell and Jonathan Bailey, along with returning characters, adds fresh dynamics to the story, yet Heartstopper never loses its grounded charm. Even without Olivia Coleman's presence as Nick's mother, the series continues to feel warm and inviting. The seasonal or milestone events in each episode, whether it's GCSE results, birthdays, or Christmas, bring a relatable structure, allowing the characters to grow while still giving fans moments of lighthearted joy. For those who have grown up with the series, or for adults who wish for more open and accepting representations of LGBTQ plus relationships in their youth, this season of Heartstopper feels like a gift. It offers an idealized yet believable vision of what teenage life could be, full of love, self-discovery, and acceptance. While the series may not have the grit of other teen dramas, its gentleness is precisely what makes it stand out. Heartstopper continues to be a soothing, comforting watch, gently guiding its characters and its viewers through the emotional highs and lows of growing up. Stay subscribed for more videos.